Hey guys, Crypto Quantum here, coming at you with another video, and today I have a nice gameplay on Stronghold here. Sorry it's not on a new DLC map, this is kind of like an old gameplay. I just haven't gotten around to posting it yet, and on the topic of not posting, I'm gonna hope to start posting a lot more soon. I just, uh, I don't know, I don't really have an excuse for not posting, I'm just kind of too lazy to do it, I guess. But, uh, shout out to Sammy here, this video is dedicated to you and your fresh cut. So... What I got here is a uh, pretty good gameplay. I, I go 23 and 1, I think. I die really close to the end, which, it like, pissed me off. But, yeah, these people are really, really bad. I was hoping to get the nuclear, but I was playing TDM. And as you can see in the beginning, I, were, I really wasn't playing there. I wasn't expecting to do this good in this game. I, I thought these people would be, you know, good. And uh, this is probably my best gameplay. So, anyways, today I'm going to have a... Uh, kind of like a story video to be telling you. And this story will be about something that happened in grade 5. This is kind of like how I met, uh, maybe like half the members of Cryptic. So, this was the year that I met, um, Nick, so Cryptic Tricky, Carter, Cryptic Apollo, and, uh, Kyle, Cryptic Kraz, and I... I met Kenneth that year. I knew Kenneth from before that, but I met Cryptic Flight that year as well. So pretty much, we had, uh, <laughs> Grade 5 was really territorial, I guess. It was, it was kind of a joke, but, uh, besides, like, so th there were these portables, and the portables all had stairs. And it was my classroom, and there were, uh, we would just stand on the portable stairs in the back, and we named it Place. And we would go to Place of a Recess, and repeatedly, we would get in trouble for not allowing people onto place, and uh, I I don't understand what the issue is here. It, it's a uh, maybe a, a one meter by one meter piece of wood. I don't know why everyone wanted to be on there. I guess it was the popular group, according to you know the teachers and every student that didn't think they were allowed to go there. We really didn't care who was there as long as it wasn't the girls that were our friends, because they had their own portable staircase just the one beside ours and we got <laughs> in a lot of trouble frequently because of this especially from this one kid um i'll name him harold so this harold here he was a uh, he was really upset because he, he thought he was a, a complete loser and he had no friends and um he would always go to place and not that we would like kick him out or anything but he would come up here and then we'd be like hey harold and then he'd be like oh you guys don't want me here and then he'd walk away and then one day he like told i don't know if it was just my teacher or if it was like all the teachers but he told on us and um we we <laughs> We were laughing the whole time because at that point we were, we were called the Wolf Pack. That was our kind of like name for place. And I had just created the female Wolf Pack, the Wolfies. That was uh, that was my doing. But um, <laughs> the teacher was like, "Oh, guys, you you can't be doing stuff like that. Uh, it's all over the announcements and stuff. You can't own the portables and all that shit." And I was like, "Yeah, but." We're not really owning them. We're allowing anyone to come on them. And they, they, they didn't really care. They were assholes. So, I just, uh, we, we kept going there until eventually, these, these dumbass kids, like, they, they just wouldn't let us sit there. We, we couldn't do anything. So, the teachers eventually, or I shouldn't say the teachers, the teachers really didn't care, except for, like, the ones that were getting complete, they were getting complaints, like, all the time about oh yo these guys won't let us on the freaking wood and I'm like oh I don't really care so eventually it got so bad that they just decided to not let us on there anymore and it was like some teachers wouldn't let us on others really didn't care but then uh, the principal got involved with all this shit and then they were like oh you're gonna have to stay off the Thing. And we're like, why? And like, oh, because you it's just a spot and it makes the other students feel bad because they, they don't feel as good as you guys because you guys are like more popular and you have all this. And we're like, okay, we're not really more popular, they, they're the same as us. So I, I, we, I just have you know, maybe more friends than them. They're allowed to come here, but they, they didn't understand that the kids like Harold here just wouldn't didn't leave us alone when it came to that little that spot we literally I don't think we ever said get out like to any of the kids unless they were like 
really young. Those are the only kids we didn't let up there because, you know, we were like 10 and then they were like, I don't know, the people that came up to us they were like 7. So, anyways, that's uh, that's pretty much the whole story about place. Uh, Grade 5 was fun, but yeah, that was the year that I met almost everyone in Cryptic. So that, that, that was kind of like the year that I started making more friends because um, in grade four I had this friend his name was Justin and um, like about half the school left to go to the French immersion school oh this is where I die yeah but about half the school went to the French immersion school and that I, I don't know I, I just didn't have most of my friends anymore because most of them went to the French immersion so I had to kind of start making new friends and we all had like common interests we all played like black ops and all that so yeah, that's the year that I met them, and it was fun. I mean, still is. And, you know, I guess we, we stayed pretty good friends, because look at us now, we have an, our own clan thing. And, yeah, this is pretty much going to sum up the video. This is the end of the gameplay here. I get final kill with that dart. Cheeky. Well, yeah, guys, thanks for watching the video. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. Shout out to Sammy and his new haircut. And, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in another video. Peace.